Folks, how are you doing today? So this just came out of the restoration shop and we have completely gone through this machine. This is a 1940s ABT shooting gallery and its nickname is the clamshell because this looks like a clamshell. You know, they start making these in the 20s and we probably have some of them on our website as well as eBay now from the 20s, which are in oak. These were the models they came out with in the 40s. This is a one cent game for 10 shots, okay? Um, and the nice thing about this, this is a special one because this is moving targets. A lot of them are stationary targets. This is a moving target game. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you how this baby works. Uh, so also, let me just say that when we got this in, all of the graphics and everything on the side were shot. So we elected to do it in these colors. We thought it was extremely appropriate and we did it with some pen striping and as well as, in many cases, we do build these cradles for them. So this cradle, this machine is simply sitting in this cradle. It's not altered or changed whatsoever, but it just gives it a nice third dimension look, which I particularly like, and so do most of our customers. So we've also put brand new decals, new glass, new side decals, everything's been polished, the gun's gone through. This is a super nice game. Now let's get to the play, okay? So it's 10 shots for a penny, and he's gonna get in here and show you because it's a moving target game. Now when you start this game, you see the last game played was a 40. You want to push the handle down and just give this enough time to reset, okay? When you let the handle up, here we go. Here goes our targets, right? Yeah. Come on, baby. Here we go. Oh, I can't seem to get past 40. We're gonna do it one more time because this is a fun game. You can get good at it. I might add that when you hit the ball, that does not consummate a score. That ball is sitting in a little divot back there, okay? You gotta knock that ball out of the divot. You can't just touch the ball. You gotta have a direct hit. So let's go again. So we're gonna let, let it reset to zero. As soon as you let the handle up, and it's on a timer, okay? Oh, come on. One. I'm not doing too good here. Okay, so I didn't do so good. Uh, there's three balls in the game, uh, four actual balls. The balls need to roll back down, get in the trough. That's the way the game was designed, and you'll see how it works when you get it. Also, Tony can come back here. He'll show you back here as well as the door has been striped all the way around. We'll give you some still shots of the interior of it. And once again, as you see right here, we had our boy Willis come in and run a silver line around this striping. We had our professional guy come in. It's really an attractive game. It's got good sex appeal. It's a hell of a lot of fun. You and your friends will have fun. I think it goes up to, I don't know, 50 or 60 or 70. So you can get pretty good at it. It's a good game to bet money on, beer drinking game. Great to go, ready to be shipped out now. So if you want to let us know, we'll get it boxed up and shipped out. Thank you so much. Yeah, what's really nice about the feet is when you lower the gun, your hand can get in there. So I kind of like the feet that are on the game. And Jim's right, the side of this was just completely shot. So we didn't go with the original graphics. We just painted it, made it look nice. And you're gonna like it, lots of fun.